Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your PHP code with Postgres database with PDO driver. Okay. And we are going to run select query on our database table. So the first thing, make sure you open text editor and create one file name sample.php. And I have starting and closing tags right here to just get started and make sure that you have your postgres service running so postgres sql start postgres sql service and make sure it is running in the background okay then the next thing that we are going to do is we are going to use our try and catch block here so that we will catch any errors if they occur okay so pdo exception and then dollar e and then we are going to echo our error with dollar e and then get message function okay so once we are through that let's go ahead and focus on our try block within which first thing that we do is we are going to write our my pdo variable that will establish the connection with new video and then here we have to mention our pg sql driver that connects with host which is local host and there is no need for our port number simply use db name equals to test bb then our username is Postgres in my case, and also password is simple for me, demo one, two, three, four. In your case, these details may vary. So do check with your local setup. Okay, next thing, create one SQL query. So we use SQL and then select star from and my company table within which I have three columns. Uh, which is ID, name, and age. Okay, so let's print out basic ID and name from that table. Okay, so I'm going to use for each loop that will take my PDO connection. So my PDO that will run a query. Okay, the query will be SQL. Okay, and then we will fetch some rows out of it okay so let's have the data to print and i'm going to break that data into new line with each row so print then a row and first thing is id then I'm going to concatenate this with simple dash. And next thing to do is call for another columns data within which I have name. And then I have this break to that table. Okay. So we used break to separate our each row result, right? Then we properly closed our for each loop, also properly closed try block, catch block, and our PHP starting and closing tag, okay? Now save your code and then go to browser and type your local host name and then sample.php. And it returns with the ID and name, ID and name. It is out of order because it's not primary ID and I have not set that up, which I should be. Then it will properly align these entries and then make it order from one to four. Okay, so this was a simple example on how to connect with your Postgres database. Then 
from table get few entries and display that on web page with your help of video driver in php